It's been said that the 501st got the best of the war. We also got the worst. Aunt Felucia, the Seps dug their metal heels into the muck of that alien hellhole and dared the Republic to come in after them. So we did. Only to be met with the month after month of flesh-eating diseases, shrieking nocturnal predators, and other sights that haunt me to this day. Cut off and for all we knew abandoned by our superiors, our only hope was Ayla Sekuda, our Jedi commander. Without her iron will, none of us would have come out of that mess with our sanity for our lives. When her death came, I hope it was quick. She earned that much. Our Ford unit is under attack by some kind of creatures. Get up there and give them some support. What is that thing? Where are they? Oh no, they're all dead! This ATTE is out of commission. Alright, so for this first part, you just gotta run over to the ATTE. You have 30 seconds to get over there. It's pretty easy. Now you need to kill these Ackley. The hit point on these things is a little tricky. But uh, I find just aiming at their stomach here is the best way to go. Um, usually with a clone trooper, you can waste about a full clip and that'll pretty much knock it out. Um, your team will also be doing some sizable damage to them. To the Ackley, so you don't really need to worry about it too much. Um, yeah, see, if, if you aim at the head, there's no hitbox there, so don't aim for the head, just aim for the stomach. Or just aim for their underside, and that'll get them. And that'll finish them off. But uh, there's three that spawn in at the beginning, and then there's three more afterwards. Um, don't bother using your grenades, as you just saw there. I firstly tossed one just to show you. Um, these things move around a lot, and uh, your grenades obviously need a minute in order to time, in order to work. So yeah, don't bother with it. Um, now if you run out of ammo, just switch to your blaster pistol. It doesn't do as much damage, but it still does a, a slightly decent amount of these things. Um, if you have the uh, uh, ammo droid here, but then you can just refill your ammo, but uh, the Ackley that I first got the attention of decided to attack the ammo box, so that so I hate him for that. But um, uh, in that opening credit, you can kind of tell that uh, uh, the voice in this, is, or the main commander, is a uh, Rex, which is kind of neat. So this. Story is so the story of CIS this game is moving in this direction. Defend the ATTE until Jedi Master Sakuda arrives. Uh, the uh, plan behind this game is sort of uh, the plot behind this game is basically um, uh, from the point of uh, from the view of uh, uh, Dang, Captain Rex of the 501st. Um, so yeah, that's pretty neat actually. I actually kind of just figured that out when I was thinking about it. I was like, that voice sounds oddly familiar, and it was like, oh right, it's Rex. So this part, this part's pretty basic. Um, basically, you just gotta defend the ATT for two minutes against these droids until uh, Ayla Sakura shows up. But you think a Jedi mess? But you think a Jedi would actually like be there on time? But nope. She wants to just camp out, maybe finish her tea or whatever. But uh, there's basically only one spot that the droids really spawn in, and that's up here. Uh, there is a spot over to the left of the a of the ATTE, but uh, they rarely spawn in over there. The thing about the clone engineer is that he takes a while to uh, reload his guns, or reload his shotgun. So that's one slight downside to him, but other than that, he's pretty powerful. Now, you do now there's no Ackley that show up on this part of the mission. Um, but there are some Ackley that show up at the last bit of the mission, but I'll get into that later.
Thanks, man. Yep, you take some. Ayla Sakuda has landed. A Republic gunship crashed in the brush near here. Acquire its power cell and bring it back to reactivate the ATTE. Now that you can, now you can play as Ayla Sakura. I like running over, just diving around and grabbing the uh, power cell in order to reactivate the ATTE first. Um, just because you can, and it's because it's super easy to do that. Nice work. Once that's done, you can play as Ayla Sakura. The CIS offensive is being mounted from the fungal tree to the south. Advance on their base of operations there and take out their primary defense turrets. Now you can either command the ATTE, which is pretty powerful, or you can go as Ayla Sakura. I'm gonna go as Ayla just because uh, I, she can take out these turrets really easy. Now, main thing, stay away from the Ackley. Like, don't try, don't even try taking on an Ackley as Ayla Sakura, because um, her attacks take a very long time to uh, register on them. Plus. So she's basically a sitting duck against Ackley. Or she's easy prey for them. Pretty much all you gotta do is jump is just jump around, take out these turrets, and then that's it. This mission's a piece of cake. It's one of the easier ones. So I'm just gonna take out this armored tank droid just because I can. And because I'm and because I just wanna have some fun. Carry the force with you. Always. Now, for some reason, that turn was able to kill me by shooting at my feet, which is really stupid, so I'm just going to go as a jet trooper and jump jet over these plants to take out that turret. I don't have an opening. There we go. But yeah, it's pretty... It's pre it's pretty easy to do this mission. It's I know I made it sort of look stupid, but I was just messing around. Nice work. The separatist assault on Felucia has been severely crippled. We have them on the run. Basically, just stay away from the Ackley when you're playing as Ayla Sakura at all times. That's basically my number one uh, tip. When the 501st was finally rotated out of Felucia, Ayla Sakura made a point of seeing us off personally, calling us the bravest soldiers she'd ever seen. It's a good thing we were wearing helmets, because none of us could bear to look her in the eye. All right, so that's the third mission. Uh, next week episode, we're going to be doing the fourth mission, which is a uh, space battle above Kashyyyk. So yeah, please stay tuned for that uh, if you're interested. Um, please uh, hit the like button if you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, thanks again for watching and uh, take care everybody.